pyramid. A mess in that place. That ribbon. The swan face is wearing. Oh, Sheriff, what a nice surprise. I'm not sure I've seen you here before. You're always welcome, of course. Is it business or pleasure? I've got some questions for Georgie. Straight to business this time, then. You're in luck. He's here. Come on. Business or pleasure, right? Hmm. I should warn you that Georgie does not like to be bothered when he's working. And working. he's in kind of a mood right now. It'll be fine. I have a way <laughs> with people. <laughs> I'm feeling so I've got to beat someone up. By someone, I mean Georgie. Keys at the ready. Welcome to the Pudding and Pie, where we cater to the diverse tastes of the Fable community. Your pleasure is our pleasure. Did you know Lily? She worked here? Oh, my lips are sealed. You'd better ask Georgie. What do you think you're doing? You look like you're trying to take a shit. Who's gonna want that? No one's gonna want that. Nice guy. Seems like a real prince. You do have a sense of humor. That's good. Good luck. Right. It's your face. You have to smile. You never smile. How many okay. times do I have to say it? You're supposed to turn the clients on. That's your... J what the fuck? Get your hand off my shit. Oh, it's Here's you. You're very friendly. You, stay right there. Don't even think about sitting down. I got a few questions. Imagine my excitement. Hmm. The other asshole. Just what do you want then? This game. You here for a little taste? Tell you what, come back after midnight, maybe. I can hook you up. Or uh, knowing you, she's probably not quite your style. You'd prefer someone who can take a bit of a beating. Tell me, do you prefer a stationary target or one that will put up a fight? Fuck you. Fuck you, Georgie. Fuck you, Georgie. It's the big bad wolf. Jesus, Big B, you're so corny. I love it, though. No, seriously, I love it. His accent's really annoying. Okay, all right, Sheriff. Just fucking with you. Is that? Look, I know why you're here. Are you sure? Listen, Sheriff. Around here, we around. can't afford to wait for you and your swanky pals to take an interest. We have to look out for each other. I'm not sure. When shit happens, I hear about it. Especially if it concerns my livelihood. In that case, I assume you knew Lily was glamour. Of course she was, you daft git. She was a troll. No. I mean glamour to look like another fable. Yeah? Well, so what? Who gives a toss? People get up to all kinds of things when nobody's watching. I think you're behind this. You got her a black market glamour as part of some twisted sex fantasy. Ooh. Black market, is it? How exciting. Just, like, this is exactly what I would face. expect from a thug like you. Storm in, throw around a bunch of accusations, try to scare people. But you've got fuck all to back it up. And we're all just meant to jump any time the wolf shows his teeth. He used to be something, you know. Now look at him. Nothing to back it up? Well, what the fuck is this, then? Get that out of my face. I found it on Lily's body, and it's definitely a back alley job. Where did she get it? You've got this all wrong. 
If Lily was doing a special glamour, it wasn't for me. For fuck's sake, I want that kind of eat. Who was she doing it for, then? She had clients, Bigby. Maybe one of them was into it. A lot of fucked up people in Fable Town. Like who? Try looking in the mirror. Anyway, now what to do with me? Go on, then! <laughs> You're gonna hit me? Go ahead! That's what you wanna do, right? Oh, yes! Oh, no! Fuck! You! Take your sad fucking face where I can't see it! Bloody bastard fucking shit! You proud of yourself, mate. Proud of your little mess. Fuck's sake. Who's that guy? Fuck off, Hans. 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 Where's Hans? Hold on a minute. Hans, is it? Which one's from? Hans just cleans up and provides a little muscle when we need it. He's not going to know anything about the girls and their clients or any of that. No one knows. Don't you get it? It's by design. Discretion is our guarantee, right? And the way we guarantee that is that no one knows anything they don't have to know. Including me. I cover my eyes and take my cut. End of story. Why not look it up? What's that? Isn't there a little book with all the stuff about the girls and all that written <laughs> in it? You're a fucking moron! Show me. There is no book. I call And as for you, Hans, we need to work on your communication skills. And have a fairly good idea where to start. Hey, that's my personal property. <laughs> sure, go ahead. Do what comes naturally. Let's smash that fucking boombox. <laughs> Unbelievable prick! Hey now! Um, I want that Cut book. the crap, Georgie. I want the book Hans is talking about. Hans is confused. Again. Don't even think about it. Do not touch that. You hear me? That's nothing to do with you. There's still time for you to just cough it up. I'm sorry, Sheriff, but there's no Andy Magic book with everything you want to know jotted down inside. I sincerely wish there was. Maybe it would get you off me back. Well, well, what's this? Looks like a floor safe. Uh, I wouldn't know. It was here when we moved in. I don't have a key to it. Sheriff, will he come on? Fuck's sake, I've got to open up bullshit. in a few hours. <laughs> <laughs> oh, was it good for you, Sheriff? Next time, I'm gonna have to charge you. Jesus, you're killing me! I'm begging you, I'll pay you. Two women are dead. Then quit being a bloody idiot. Come on, mate. Leave it. There's nothing there for you. Oh, yes. <sighs> I'm feeling very evil. This is a dance club. What the hell am I supposed to do tonight while the girls are on stage? Harmonica, kazoo, whistle a happy tune. Fucking unbelievable. Bloody okay. come on, then. <laughs> trash my business over this bullshit. Protector of Fable Town, my ass. If you just hand over the crap. book at the start, then you wouldn't have had to do any of this, so Once fuck again, you, don't Georgie. Get your so fuck you, there's Georgie. There's nothing in here that'll tell you anything. But it's a kick to the balls for me and my club, so he can be happy about that. Ooh, money. Here, this is Lily's last entry. So tell me, Georgie, who's this Mr. Smith? Oh dear. I'm afraid it might be a fake name, Bigby. 
Secrecy is sort of how this all works. Even Ants knows that. What's 207? Room number? I don't fucking know. Millimeters, maybe? Don't bullshit me, Georgie. This is your book. Your girls. I'm not their fucking secretary. I give them a stage. I give them music. I provide an erotic venue to attract and retain clients. But let's be clear on something. The girls make the arrangements with their clients, not me. The girls. They're the ones with the Mr. Smiths and Joneses and Mr. X types. Whatever happens outside the club, that's on them. I log the business, take my cut, and I'm out. Now, I've had quite enough of you and your bullying. Excuse me while I call your superiors to make a complaint. Can I have to get through the system? Hello? Business office? Lipstick, lip gloss, compact, glitter. Don't I'm looking at all these, but why not? Note. Faith, thanks for covering for me tonight. Let's talk before you go over to the apartment. Lily. Looks like they both saw one of Lily's clients. Oh, shit. So it's definitely the person who... Um, sorry, what? Uh, definitely the person who... I'm just very distracted. The person who uh, saw Lock's been Lily. busted open. Broken open. But there isn't even a lock. Excuse me. I heard you out there. I don't remember ever seeing you here before. Somebody else said that to me on the way in. I guess we're all surprised. Lost cat, Pixel. It was the cat. <laughs> You're trying to place me. They used to call me the Little Mermaid. Once Ten upon a dead, time. You've got new legs. <laughs> does that help? You have legs. Had a glamour? No, they're real. Do you like them? They cost me a lot. My name is Nerissa. Well, Nerissa. I've got some questions. Of course you do. I don't have answers. You'll have to find those yourself. Does the number 207 mean anything to you? I assumed it was a room number, but where? We can't talk about work. This is a murder case. I mean can't. These lips are sealed. Discretion is our guarantee. I assume it's a spell, then. It's how things work here. People keep using those phrases. What does it mean? This is what I need to know about. Lily's last entry. Who's Mr. Smith? Where's room 207? I have to know. These lips... Sheriff Wolf, would you like to make an appointment with me? Well, if you go that way. Okay. <laughs> what would I need to do? I need 150. It's not good to be short. There's a big wad of money which we just keep collecting from people. Wait here for a second. <laughs> I'm evil. Mm. 
not 207? You'll think of something. The open arms. Hmm. This is where they met. Enjoy your the stay. Open arms, eh? I hope you find what you're looking for. A lot to make them cry. I should have smashed up everything. It had been so much more fun. A Monday carpet. Eh? 